them artists for humanity. 16-year-old artist Tercia Moda sold her first painting this summer. The painting sold for $250, but what this Brockton teen received was worth more than cash. How does it make you feel when someone actually wants to buy your painting? Yeah, it made me feel so accomplished. It made me like really feel like, wow, I'm really an artist, you know, because at 16 years old, I'm like, okay, I'm making paintings that look nice, but I'm never really going to sell anything. Nobody's really going to think my stuff's that nice. And it really made me feel like accomplished and like, I'm really making something of myself and, you know. So it's like now we're building our own My Enterprises. She was among eight Brockton students who took part in a program called My Enterprises, which aims to help city youth turn their talent into commerce. Former Brockton mayoral candidate Jay Stewart says he founded the program this summer to help city youth use their creativity to become entrepreneurs. My Enterprises is, real, is modeling after uh, Artists for Humanity, which is a really incredible program in Boston. It serves over 1,400 students a year. It's more than just an art program. It's an entrepreneurial program. It's a space where kids take ownership, uh, uh, become more responsible. Uh, all the things that we said we want our young people to uh, you know, get involved in is what this organization is about. Like you can also um, keep kids um, out of the streets, mm -hmm. um, like focus on better things. For seven weeks, the teens took the train into Boston every day and were paid $8 an hour to work in a studio at Artists for Humanity alongside other art professionals. There, the teens created art while some worked as graphic designers. It really opens your eyes to like how fast you can get clients for graphic design and stuff like that. So it's like, wow, I'm actually designing stuff. This is your self-portrait. Yeah, this is my self-portrait. The first, at Artists for Humanity, they have you start off with a self-portrait. And this is what I did. It was my first time doing anything in black and white. And I wanted it to be different, so I decided, I, my glasses are very part, like they're very important in me. So I decided to make everything that's inside the glasses in color. So just like, you see what I see. The students will display their artwork at the Fuller Craft Museum on September 10th. We're using Artists for Humanity as, as a, an initial model, but I envision my enterprise is growing into a place where if you're a writer, you can come to us and find someone who can mentor your writing and maybe get your work published. If you are a, a kid who's walking around with tons of ideas, my enterprises will be a place where you can bring your inventions and there will be people at this organization will help you go through the whole patent process and get it marketed. Stewart says he is working to anchor the entrepreneurial program in Brockton next year so more Brockton youth can participate. Maria Papadopoulos, The Enterprise.